food truck, we officially call it the Tin Toad. When the campers come up, they can order, uh, order one of these three uh, piggies. The Perfect Piggy, the Skinny Piggy, or my favorite, the Jammin' Piggy. Their food is delivered on a slide in the back. This thing is just a ton of fun. Everything is better when you eat it outdoors. No, no, This is a long haul. It seats 64 people. It's air conditioned. Wow, what a wonderful addition. This week we're feeding 480 people each meal. And if we didn't have this dining room right here, there would be at least 45 campers that wouldn't be able to be here this week. No! Here we are at the Anvil, and there are three events here that the juniors get to go through, or anybody at the Broken Eye Ranch. Eventually there's gonna be nine. This is a cool little course where you get to work together as a team, learn different principles of teamwork. This is a fun thing. They get their treasures, they get their jewels. They're working through all the details of being a team. No! The second sentence of the Ironwood mission statement says that Ironwood is a place of decisions in the area of salvation, full surrender, and consistent Christian walk. One of the new traditions we want to start here is the wall of decisions. And here's the way it works. You would take one of these little uh, circles here and you would write your name and maybe the date and the decision that you've made and then add it to the wall of decision as a reminder to everybody else and a uh, testimony that you have of the decision that you've made here at camp. Number six. This has been a really fun ad. This is like an adventure meal down at the lake. We've got original barbecue uh, right here, a little buffet area, a place to do preparation. Two times a week, uh, we have lunch down here with the juniors and then they head off to swimming after that. This has been just fun. Number We're here at the Make It Mercantile, and this place is now functional. It is not finished by any stretch of the imagination, but we've got 40 or 50 chairs in here, several tables. The place is cooled, lighted, set to go. We've got the kitchen right back here where we're able to even do crafts, where we have demonstrations uh, there at the kitchen. Eventually, all of this will have uh, shelving and we'll have all kinds of crafts available. This summer, we're using this cool spot for buttons, for t-shirts, for both junior camp and team camp. Number four! Okay, one of the things that we wanted to add was a rolling log in the lake. When I was a kid, we had this rolling log and it's really cool. So we stuck a log in the lake and it's now a rolling log. See? <laughs> okay, okay. So, so we need to go to plan B. Uh, our logs are like hippopotamuses. They don't float. They just, they kind of sit in there. That's like a two foot log that's sitting in there. It'll be better next year, I promise you. <laughs> Three! We're here at the branding porch here at the Make It Mercantile. Oh, this is a ton of fun. Every camper gets their own board right here. And then when it's their turn, they get to, and they heat everything up in the forge. Over a hundred brands here that they're able to choose from. Numbers, letters, shapes, all kinds of stuff. And they can design whatever they want right here. They heat it all up, they brand it, oh, fire, smoke. It is such a cool thing. This is our third escape room and it's got all kinds of little puzzles, little things that you've got to figure out, locks and keys all over the place. This escape room right here has a great balance of like things to do, things to figure out. Everybody gets signed up for that. They've got the maze right here. They've got to pull the brake. They're separated into two different teams. They've got to get everybody together. The escape room, again, great addition to this summer. <laughs> So we're showing you all kinds of new activities and fun things to do, but we've also got some brand new camps and you'll want to take a look at the website and see more about these. But real quick, here they are. One is called Refresh Her. That's a camp specifically for pastor's wife, limit of 40. You're going to want to sign up for that one right away. There's also All Terrain. This one is a dinner and then a breakfast. You bring your own lodging, you bring your own equipment that you're going to ride all over the desert in. We're located way out in the middle of nowhere. Guys, girls, families, uh, fathers father, son, father, daughter. There's also spring horsemanship. Spring horsemanship is just a short camp, just half a week in the springtime, kind of that spring break. You get a chance to ride horses. The very end of that one's really fun as the whole family has a, uh, the opportunity to participate in the showdio. And then lastly, we've got ministry outfitters. Boy, this is for 10th through 12th graders. It's in December, and this is to help inspire and to help uh, prepare young people who are looking to go to a future in full-time ministry. That camp is free. You need a pastor recommendation, you're going to want to look all four of these camps up. They're brand new and you can get more information on the website. Number six. Number six. 
Number six. Number six. Oh. Number number six. six. <laughs> Did we get it? No.